So here you are once again, the oldest story in the book. It's 3 a.m. and you're here watching cat videos on YouTube. Your assignment's due tomorrow and you haven't started yet. You've got your Red Bull, you've been drinking it, but you're not really feeling the wings right now. Matter of fact, you're pretty much fucked because you're gonna have to stay up all night and produce this assignment. Or maybe it's been six weeks since that boss gave you that report to do and you haven't started. Now it's due tomorrow and you're scrambling around the office trying to figure out what the hell you should do. Now you see procrastination? Procrastination is truly some bullshit. But it doesn't have to be that hard, guys. It doesn't have to be this way. Why do we procrastinate? Well, basically, it's because of the human mind's tendency to take the path of least resistance. There's actually a law created called Parkinson's Law that states that work expands so as to fill the time available for its completion. So regardless of what time you're given, two weeks, three weeks, four weeks, you're going to spend the whole time. And 99.9% .9 of the time, you're going to procrastinate for most of the time. So it doesn't have to be this way. I'm going to give you three tips to get you going to stop procrastination. Because it's a habit and you definitely can kill habits. All right, so tip number one. You're going to have to motivate yourself to start. Just motivate yourself to start for 15 minutes. Just 15. No, actually, motivate yourself to start for fucking five minutes. Just five minutes. Because you see, half the time we procrastinate is because we make the task we have to do some huge, insurmountable thing in our head. Some Goliath. Some mammoth. We have to conquer it. And we connect and associate all sorts of negative emotions with it. So... That's why we do it. But if you can chunk it down, cut it into a thousand tiny pieces, make it so small that you can just down the smallest thing, whether it's like if the boss wants you to write the report, maybe you just write the introduction. If you have to do some math problems, just start off by doing one math problem. If you have to make a video for YouTube, just do the recording. Just motivate yourself to start. Think of the smallest thing, the smallest unit of activity that you can do and do that what you'll notice is half the time procrastination is simply the inertia that's stopping you the inertia of the task once you get a little bit of momentum it's like rolling a ball down freaking mount everest it's gonna keep going so that's half your battle done there if you just start start for five minutes figure out the smallest thing you can do and then get that all right tip number three Change your thinking, change your thoughts. See, when we procrastinate, a lot of times we have negative thoughts about the activity we have to do. Generally, we'll be thinking, oh man, I have to do this shit. I don't want to do it. Oh, it's going to be so much work. No, oh, why me? You see, you got to change that. that that's, a, that's a bullshit mentality. You want to be excited about the results. Think about what can happen when you complete this task. What's the results? Are you going to get high distinction from university? Are you going to make all kinds of money once you write this book and sell it? Or perhaps your boss is going to congratulate you and say, hey, man, you did a good job. Here's a promotion. Think of the positive. Think of the upside. Don't think about the task itself. Think about how much better the consequences will be if you do the task well. All right, because I love you, I'm going to give you one more tip. Tip number four, reward yourself. Set rewards for yourself. What are you going to do once you complete the work? Are you going to binge out on Netflix? Are you going to binge out on KFC? You got to set rewards for yourself. You got to have something to work for. Human beings were influenced by incentives. So what is your incentive to do the work? Have something. Make it clear. Have a big picture right in front of you of the thing you're going to do. Have a big picture of the KFC 12-piece feed you're going to buy. Wow. Have the Netflix ready to download. Actually, don't do that. You might just end up watching the Netflix. But have a reward for yourself. And this will really help you do the work. Anyway, guys, those are my tips. If you take them seriously, you will probably not have procrastination as a problem again. And if you still have procrastination as a problem, you're fucked. Too bad. Anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. I'll be seeing you guys soon. Peace. I'm going to show you how to be part of the notification gang. It's real simple. Click subscribe, and then you click on this little bell here. Boom, bang, boom. That's it. And you get notifications as soon as the videos are up. Peace. Do it! Just do it!